Northern Carers Network it primarily is supporting anyone in the community, family members or friend of people who have a disability, or they might be frail because of their age, um, or they may have a mental illness, illness or some sort of chronic illness. So that's who carer support is for in the northern suburbs. Um, we have quite a significant program for um, people who, have, um, who are culturally have from cold backgrounds, they're culturally and linguistically diverse backgrounds. We run a whole range of flexible programs for people from cold communities. Northern Carers Networks run a range of support groups. Um, so, for example, that's um, slides there up there. It's one of those Carers Day Out that we do. Um, we run support groups in um, mix um, culturally diversity. So our support groups goes um, bi-monthly due to the carer's request. So um, therefore we run our support groups based on our carer's request. But not only that, it's a mix culturally diversity um, and we work with our carers to support them in their individual needs. So that blank banners up there is designed by our carers, um, based mix of the support groups and culturally diversity. Each of those flowers up there is represent um, each one of them individuals for their country, where they come from, and their hands are joining together as a unique of carer support in the northern region. Um, it's also representing who they are as a carers in their unique role. So the Northern Carers Network, as you can see on the slide, um, has a huge boundary, a huge region where we provide our services. Um, we cover the regions of the city of Tea Tree Gully, the Enfield part of Port Adelaide, Enfield region, um, the city of Playford, the city of Salisbury, and also, which is not quite marked clearly on the map, but also Gawler, which is a sub-country region. So we run programs, an outreach program throughout the whole region. Um, a number of about 33 support groups. We run carer day outings um, and a whole range of programs um, throughout that region, as you can see. There are, according to Carers SA, um, 31,720 carers in South Australia, and of this, there are 2,906 um, from Aboriginal background and approximately 222,000 from called communities. But it is, as you can understand too, they're probably um, an underestimate of the numbers of carers in, in the state and in the country. This is a bit of a picture to give an idea of the diversity of carers in our community. Everybody is a member of the community and as you can see, anybody at any given time can become a carer. Um, elderly people often are carers of children or grandchildren. Um, young carers may be caring for their grandparent or a brother or sister with a disability. We support carers um, of all ages and we work with um, every sector of the community. Parenting services, old people, aged care services, disability services, mental health services. And then if you're working with the called community, there is often additional issues um, around cultural and religious barriers. There's um, a number of things that we do, we work very closely with um, the called communities. The Cambodian community is one example. We've often worked with them. Um, they run a couple of support groups in their language. So we support the carers to attend those groups. Um, we don't necessarily go along to the groups ourselves always, but we may help out with some, some sort of transport, if respite um, and anything else that is needed to help the community access their local support group. So um, bringing cultures together is one of those events that we do um, with the Aboriginal community. Um, it's also to raise awareness for the core community that we are here in Australia, living in a Western world, and Aboriginal um, community is part of who we are today. Um, so we um, run a couple of bringing cultures together in the past couple years. Um, as to celebrate carers' um, weeks in multiculturals um, during that day. So um, we have Aboriginal um, activities, um, Ghana's welcomes and also the Ghana um, dance and also bringing the converting community um, to the events to celebrate um, the difference in um, the cultures and also the Vietnamese community and other communities as well. 
and um, Northern Carers Networks run Carers Day Outs once a month um, for carers um, and in general carers um, with language barrier as well as um, multicultural carers. We also run a range of support groups for Aboriginal um, community and one of those is the grandparents um, caring for their grandkids. Um, Northern Carers Networks also have a privilege of um, having other um, organisations to support us in fundings um, to run family camp. We have generally around 10 families to our camps and um, supporting families as a unique role um, and their siblings as well. So Northern Carers Network is very, very strong in working together with other agencies and partnerships um, to provide the best ultimate outcomes for carers in the community. And this is just a list and, an, and a range of the different services that we work very closely with for the best outcomes. It's a community development approach, a holistic approach to carer support. And I think that is one of the reasons why Northern Carers has, has been able to successfully um, work very closely and support carers from called from different cultural backgrounds and from Aboriginal communities as well. We work together in partnership with carers, walk their journey, find out what their um, individual situations are and do our best to help them to work out their, um, their next steps in, in getting support. The programs, the activities, the support rooms are basically tools that we use to enable um, us to have the opportunity to assist carers to have a better health, better well-being um, and are supported within their caring roles.